does not obey the court's order and gets in trouble again or fail to do what's in the or fail to do what's in the treatment plan, then we got power. We can submit to the DA's office an affidavit. Then it goes to the court because we are requesting OJA a detention order to lock that kid up and check this power out. So if the court finds that it's necessary, signs the order. And then I give the order to the police or to the sheriff or whoever, you know, to go pick them up, <laughs> you know, whatever, you know. I must admit, I've gone with them at times, you know, because of my police and district court juvenile officer, you know, and law enforcement experience. But think about that power where you can just go to somebody's home, the police, you know, mom, dad, the kids there, whoever's there. 